there on tight ends looking to find seams in the secondary. It's Gates' Chargers going up against Allen's Colts. So let's go now to San Diego, California, where Jim and Phil are on the call. Aaron's back, ready to field the opening kick. And Nick Novak is ready to get this one started. We're underway here. Brown's got it. And the tackle's made. The offense will start their drive from about the 31. At quarterback, physically gifted and brilliantly minded, the leader of this bunch is quarterback Andrew Luck. Andrew Luck is a big, strong quarterback, and this guy's going to run the football, so you better be alert. When you're dropping back in pass coverage, he could take off. Snap it at the 31. Luck and the Butler's the one who brings him to the ground. He has carried the load for his teams his entire career. Running back Frank Gore out of Miami. Yeah, it's amazing when you talk about Frank Gore. I always say, well, this is probably going to be his last year. I think I started seeing that about five years ago, and he can still run with the best of them. The Chargers with a nickel look here on defense. The Colts from the 32. Gore's got it on the handle. Setting the defense today. A former first-round pick out of Illinois is Corey Legion. Yeah, he's so nimble for a big guy. You look at that body, uh, and it is big. He is talented, but what a pair of feet. He can run you over or go around you. The defense looking for one more stop here on third down after that run. The Colts have to get to the 41 for a first. Looking at every option. Hilton's there to catch the ball that had a lot of heat on it. Tough to blitz this offense, man. They are so well taught. And that time they pick up the blitz, and the quarterback throws it down the field to get a completion. First down here after the completion. Four. Now cutting to the right side, looking for some open space. Gore's never able to build up that power that he has as a running back when there's nowhere to go. Hey, there's nowhere to go. That's a short game. It's now second down. The Chargers lined up in the nickel. Stands in the pocket. But it's incomplete. Not a good job by the defense that time. They let the wide receiver get behind them, but the quarterback a little off target, and they missed the big play. This is third down. The Chargers defense now loading up, expecting pass with a dime defense. Andrew Luck in shotgun formation. They're set to punt it away now. And that punt is going out of bounds. They are not going to allow them to return it. The Chargers offense is led by quarterback 
Phillip Rivers. Yeah, Phillip Rivers, when you talk about him, I don't know what you say. He's crafty, just has a way of getting it done, and he's a tremendous leader for the football team. down at the 23 scanning the field Melvin Gordon another in a long line of great running backs out of Wisconsin and he can certainly be the guy that is the featured back for this roster I know this when I saw him in college and getting ready for the draft I thought that he is the surest thing as a running back in the NFL he's going to come in and have success and be a terrific pro second and ten surveys and Gates has got it Gates continues his Hall of Fame career with another reception. Yeah, he had a little rebirth, didn't he? He finally got healthy. You, you, we got to see what he really is. Uh, he was fighting through so many injuries to his feet, his ankles. When healthy, Antonio Gates could still get down the field. The line of scrimmage, the 48. First down, following the long play. Rivers will take the snap from the gun. Jones hauls it in. Picks up eight here. Well, I guess the best thing to say there, Jim, is they completed a pass, but it still did not get a first down. After that grab, it's now second down and two. The Colts at at the line. Dime package. Gordon's going to take the handoff now. Butler's there to make the stop. Gordon is a very smart runner. He knows situations in the game. He saw the first down yard markers, and what does he do? He gets past them and picks up the first down. First down here. The Colts defense now is going to go nickel. Handoff by Rivers. Langford's able to read that play and make the hit. The Colts guessed right on the defensive side that time. They thought it was going to be a run play. They were all over it, and they got it in the backfield and made the tackle. The line of scrimmage is the 38-yard line. Second down and 11. Feeds him again. The leader of this defense is linebacker Dequell Jackson. Every defense needs a guy who just knows how to get the ball carriers to the ground, and that explains Dequell Jackson. And it's third and ten here after the run. Out of the shotgun formation. Scans the field. And the catch is made by Woodhead. The Chargers on their offensive play sheet, they don't have many plays for third and long situations. But that is a really nice job that time by the offense, the quarterback. They pick up the first down. That'll get you going. One more snap and another quarter is in the books. First down and ten. Gordon's taking the handoff. And that's a gain of maybe five. 
The first quarter comes to an end, and you're watching the NFL on EA Sports. Papa John's, where you always get better ingredients, better pizza. The Chargers still possess the football as we begin the second quarter. The offense coming to the line inside the opponent's 20. Gordon's lined up in a single back formation. And the second quarter is underway with this snap. Jackson's the one who made the big stop. The Colts' defense is so fast and so powerful. That time of the run play, they just overpower the offensive line and they tackle the runner for a loss. Third down now. Rivers out of the gun. Throws the pass. And there's Gates. And Lowry's there to take him down. Anytime you pick up a third long in the NFL, that is a confidence booster to all the players on the offensive side and also the head coach, and maybe most importantly, the offensive coordinator. Now he can just let it go. Rivers has now completed four in a row. That long gain sets them up here on this play. Gordon's handed the football. Jones is all over that offense and brings him down. What a job by the defense down on the goal line. They were playing run all the way. It was a run. They got to penetration and they tackled the runner for a loss. Marching down the field and taking their time. Second and goal at the two. The defense gets the sack. How about the defense on that play? They were not fooled. They see the pass coming. They get the penetration. They get to the quarterback quick. And that's a big sack down near the goal line. Stepping up, ready to spring into action at the eights. The Colts with two extra defensive backs in the dime. Third and goal from the eight. Looking at every option. And intercepted. And Lowry's not going to test the coverage this time as he takes a knee. This defensive coordinator, he is one aggressive dude. He keeps going after this offense. And finally, he gets the interception inside uh, their own 20-yard line and stops the offense from getting any points. The Chargers defense got tested on that last drive, but eventually it led to a punt. Yeah, it was an awesome job by the defense. They really did a lot of things correct. They hustled. They play hard. That is the cornerstones of any good defense. The Colts walk to the line. Tie game. The score, zero to zero. First down at the 20. Luck connects with Hilton. And Weddle is able to bring it to an end. T.Y. Hilton has become a main go-to guy now in this league. Yeah, such speed, a dynamic receiver. And when you move him around and let him get a free release, in other words, where nobody hits him, when the play starts, he is as fast as anybody in the NFL.
It's an empty backfield for Luck this time. Now first and ten. Luck can't find the target. Incomplete. Takes the snap. We're about midway, second quarter. Underneath and incomplete that time. Following that incompletion, it sets up third and ten. The Chargers' defense brings in an extra member of the secondary. They'll go nickel. Stands in the pocket. Moncrief's got the catch on the touch throw. Well, he had all day long to throw the football that time. That's why he had success throwing the football down the field. I'll tell you what, this defense, they need to start blitzing this quarterback. Let's see what they do on first down following that huge play. Luck will take the snap from the gun. Rip Whalen with the catch. Robinson's in on the tackle. Good job by the quarterback that time. He didn't take the bait. He didn't throw it down the football field. He threw it short to the open receiver, and we've seen it so many times. Throw it to the guy is open and see if the defense can make the tackle. Two-minute warning. Glad to have you back as we come out of the two-minute warning here in the first half. The defense is ready to plug up the middle here on the goal line. First and goal. Here's the hand. Jams it across the goal line for the touchdown. Ah, oh, you just love it as a quarterback. You get down in there and it's first to go. If you score, now you don't have to sweat the fact that, man, what are we going to do if it gets the third down? You don't have to worry about it. Good run. Nice touchdown. The Colts getting set for the point after. The point after is good. Luck's going to have a tough time upstaging what he did on that scoring drive, passing for over 80 yards against a defense that had no answers for him. The Chargers ready to return the kick. And he'll start his return. And the tackle's made right around the 32-yard line. Here's Allen taking the field again. He's been off his game in this first half, Phil. 
Yeah, it's been an awful game all around, but the star wide receiver is having an absolute terrible day so far. And if they want to win, he better pick it up, find ways to get open, and hope this quarterback gets him the football. The Chargers come to the line in a tight game here in the second quarter. The scores 7 to 0. The Colts will come out in the dime. The Chargers from the 32. Scanning the field. What a catch. Adams there to make the tackle. The Chargers have leaned on their tight end in the passing game to this point, and Gates has been a focal point for this offense here in the first half. Anytime you have a tight end with talent, you want to get them involved in the passing game. You know why? Because it's a mismatch. They're going against linebackers, safeties, guys who are not as athletic as they are. Coming to the line at the 32. First and ten. Rivers finds Allen. That's his first reception today. Situations you go over so many times in practice and training camp. Know what's going on in the offensive side. How to preserve time. Good job that time by the offensive player. Get out of bounds and giving his team more chances to get it done here in the first half. First down, offense readying for the snap. Let's see how they back up the big play here. Rivers out of the gun. Surveys. Rivers. Touchdown. San Diego Chargers. Boy, things suddenly feel a lot different as that touchdown ties things, Phil, right before the intermission. Oh, yeah, it just changes everything. It puts one team in a funk because they let the other team tied up. And, of course, when you're the team that's behind and you score that touchdown to tie it up before halftime, man, that makes you feel great. The Chargers now with the extra point to tie the game. And the extra point is good. The Colts will get the ball back in a tie game. First half coming to a close. Scores 7-7. Seven to seven. Brown's got a chance to return this one. And he's on the sidelines and out of bounds. That returns good for about 33. The Colts offense preparing to get this drive underway. Their last possession ended in a touchdown. Phil, let's see if they can do it again. Very well done. Love what I saw out there on the offense the last time. They mixed it up and they showed a lot of confidence. You can see the speed of the football team and try to duplicate what they just did. At the 34, 66 yards from pay dirt. The Chargers with a nickel look here on defense. Luck out of the gun. And it's in the hands of Hilton. And that's a gain of 10. The Colts signal for a timeout. They have two remaining.
Luck's got it in the gun. Incomplete, almost going in the other direction. Here we have second down. He'll take the snap from the gun. Frank Gore with the catch. So far, wonderful execution in this drive. When you get a chance to get out of bounds, here the offensive player got the yardage, had a chance, gets out of the bound, stops the clock. Good job by the offense. They'll set up now at midfield. The Chargers come out in a dime package. Luck standing back in the shotgun ready for the snap. Johnson's going to pull in the bullet pass. The Colts one timeout remaining. be very useful for the offense they're now ready to go the football is at the 38 Frank Gore is in the backfield. Back to the air here on first down. Frank Gore with the catch. Gore is taken down at the 25. Nobody cares. Just get the job done. Throw it deep down the field or throw it short to the running back and look at those extra yards after the short pass. Lux completion percentage, 60% on the day. The offense is set at the line for the first down after that completion. Lux back in shotgun formation. It's caught by Dante Moncrief. The Colts call a timeout here. They have zero timeouts remaining. Chip shot here. And converts on the three. One half down and both offenses still searching for answers. We've got a defensive battle on our hands and Larry Ridley is coming up next. Thanks, Jim, and welcome to the EA Sports